Welcome to Backwards News. Rants you can trust. Warning, this is a rant channel. All persons in this video are real and the events are factual. Satirical speech may be used to comment and criticize on subjects. All right, glad you can make it. Backwards news, hot off the press. We got we got problems. We hey, like it and share it. But we got some problems. We got sex freaks up the yazoo. Now, University of Michigan got this sex scandal going on with Bo Schembechler and Dr. Anderson. They're dead, but we still feeling the pain. We, we got to do something. At the last count, we got 900 people signing a lawsuit. We got investigations going and we got more and more and more problems. I'm going to tell you a secret. University of Michigan tried to be slick. They went and bought Dr. Anderson's practice and took all the medical files and hid them and they keeping them a secret. They arguing with U with U of M over all the medical files. Now we didn't did three or four investigations, but they say, uh, uh, I got more answers. I got more questions. I got more questions. Where the where the records? I don't know. I don't know. So they done turned up the heat. They put Michigan Attorney General Dana Nessel up in it. They put her up in it. They say, you're going to get up in this. I don't care if, he your, if, if that's your friend. If you went to that school, you up in it. Because it's just too much mess. They done bought, bought a doctor's practice just so they can hide the damn records. This, this is crazy. This Lifetime movie. This don't make no sense. How much a doctor practice costs? I can't afford one. So we have an ex-football player. Oh, he, he done blew his top. He blew his top. Mr. John Vaughn. He done blew his top. If you don't know, I'm going to tell you. He, they said every man and woman that went before Dr. Robert Anderson had a forensic anal exam or pelvic exam at the forensic I ain't coming I ain't coming out to Christmas so tough ass football player John Vaughn got strength to tell his story he said oh my story's worse he told me to help in some kind of experiment uh, where he taking all the top athletes and looking at their sperm. So John Vaughn, he was manipulated and played with or whatever until he ejaculated and gave up sperm samples. So now he said, where is my sperm sample? Where is my sperm sample? Where is my DNA? They got the rumor going out. Dr. Anderson was taking it to a fertility clinic and selling it. So now he losing his mind. He going bonkers. Tell me, how many kids do I have out in the world? I, I want my seed back. I feel the blood of my children. When I walked down the street, uh, I knew I knew that person looked like me. He going crazy right now. I want the records. I want to find my kids. I want my kids. I want my grandkids. 
So we it's it's over. It's over. I can't take it. I can't take it. This man is looking for his kids and his grandkids. His sperm was stole from him. Stolen sperm. Cause somebody help me find my stolen sperm. He said he did not sign any type of agreements where his sperm would be given to a fertility clinic. And he don't he he's gone bonkers. How much how much money? How much money is the university gonna pay for this one? How do you how do you pay for this? Bo knows. The staff knew everybody know what was going on, but they didn't want to talk about it. University of Michigan might as well close the door. Close the damn door. The, uh, set, sell the seats. Sell the seats. Sell t-shirts or something for the next 50 years. Sell t-shirts. Because he going to want money. He going to want money for all his kids. This is a damn shame. Backwards News.